how to use a solar battery bank. Thanks to Big Tom Span for donating these. We're finding out that some people in the Hurricane Helene afflicted area in my part of Tennessee aren't really sure how to use them, so this video will help. It is so easy to learn how to use a solar charger power bank. Open it up and you've got the solar power bank user manual, USB-C cord, and the solar power bank itself. This one has some nice features. You have the carabiner so you can hook it on to anything that you would like. The power button is on the side. Press it once and you can see how much battery life you've got. This one's pretty full. Hold it for a long press and it turns into a good bright flashlight. Press it once after it's lighted and it flashes. Uh, the next press turns it into a strobe. Let's take that off of there. It's got the bumpers on it, so it kind of acts like your cell phone protective covers. To charge it, I recommend that the first time you open this up and charge it, that you charge it on shore power, but this one's already at 100%. So to do this, all you do is you look for the part that says USB, click it open, and you've got your USB-A's, your USB-C, and your micro USB is take the USB-C cable that came with it, plug it into the USB-C port, and plug it to your wall adapter. Now it does not come with a wall adapter. You will either need to use the one that came with your phone or you're going to need to buy one. So I recommend you charge it up this way the first time you get it. Now this one's already charged. So I don't need to leave it on charge. We're going to take that off and let me show you how to charge your cell phone. And take your USB-A, plug it into this port, and plug this part into your phone just as you usually would. In just a few seconds it should light up just the same as if you had it in a wall charger to let you know it's charging. Show you how to charge it in the sun. The length of time it takes to charge this is going to depend on how sunny it is outside. If it's bright and sunny, you're going to want to give it a good two or three hours at minimum. But if it's cloudy, it's going to take longer. But let me take this outside and just show you how, how easy it is. All you do is put it directly in the sun and you can see it already starting to light up to let you know it's charging and when you plug your phone in do it in the same way I showed you a minute ago and that's all you do to charge your solar power bank in the sun. We've talked about using these solar power banks for disasters but they're also good for everyday use at home. If you have any questions drop them down there let me know and follow me for more travel lifestyle and service dog videos. Here's Pipsy. Bye. You're such a good boy. I love you.